Hi, this is Brian Oliva at Gethsemane Music. When the new uh, 2022 reissue of the Moog Model D came out, it turns out the first 1130 or so units had a circuit board that had a couple resistors that were uh, not to the spec that was intended. The result of that is that uh, if you tried to patch the aftertouch to something like the filter, Instead of having full control of it, basically it was acting like an on and off switch. So if you push down on the key using any amount of pressure, it would instantly go to full. And you let go, it would you know, shut off again. A lot of people might have never noticed that. But uh, Moog did, and eventually he uh, requested that anybody uh, with a lower serial number send the unit back to have uh, the unit replaced, which is what I've finally get around to doing this week. So my Model D is back and it works perfectly now. So when you uh, press the key, you can control things like the filter and uh, it behaves the way it was intended.